Hey guys, I am Chris, and welcome back to the Magic School Bus, Age of the Dinosaurs. So, last time we figured out uh, something rather disastrous, besides the fact that I forgot to put on my timer. We forgot, well, we didn't forget anything. We found out that we're not actually looking for meat-eating dinosaurs, as we were promised on the first episode. In fact, we are looking for dinosaurs that are not dinosaurs, or reptiles that aren't dinosaurs, or something like that. Either way, let's find out what we're actually looking for and why we've come to Alberta to fail at finding it. This reptile's name means fish lizard. Fish around and see if you can take its photograph. Go ahead. This sea-dwelling reptile behaved much like a dolphin, and even gave birth to live young. I last saw this creature in the Tethys Sea, swimming. What else? I see. See you again soon! So I'll give you a brief A dash to the dash, is it? See you later! Give you a brief introduction to the Backbus Dinatorium, but for right now, we are going to the Tethys Sea. Jurassic Tethys Sea. Yep, that's where we're going. And I want a picture of that. I do hope that our time machine pulls us through. Is there a particular reason it wouldn't? Here we go to Jurassic Tethys Sea, 150 million years before the present. These are incredible animations for... I believe this game came out in 1997. So, you know, that's pretty good for the early 90s. Or early 90s, late 90s. I'm sorry, are we a Stegosaurus-like creature to go swimming in the deep? What? Welcome to the Tethys Sea, everyone. Let's head outside and go get that picture, shall we? Why is there a bug in the world? Yo, this is Carlos. Cool rocking your Jurassic party. 150 million years ago in the Tethys Sea. I want to give a shout out to the plesiosaurs, the ichthyosaurs, and all the giant ammonites. Thank you. Let's get this picture, then we'll go exploring. Is it... Hey, it's you. Aha. Oh, that's not the critter we're looking for. I'm sorry. Don't worry, though. Just keep trying. Are we not looking for a fish lizard that's like a dolphin? Come back soon! Yeah, we're looking for... Is it... You? No, that isn't the creature we need for my photo album, but we'll find it. I feel cheated. Oh, what do you have to say for yourself, Ralphie? There were tons of these ammonites in the Jurassic Park. Uh -huh. Some of them grew shells that were six no, feet around, no. like this one. Yes. Congratulations! You found the missing creature! This critter's picture is going right where it belongs. In the photo album. Let's check it out. There's nothing icky about this ichthyosaurus photo. What a splendid picture from Jurassic Tethys Sea. You can find out about the next missing beast by clicking on the right corner of the album to turn the page. Only two more to go. There's no picture there. Come back soon. Did the game full on crash for a second? Ooh, 
Ooh, so you're ready to find the next missing critter? Just click on the red crystal to hear some clues. Go to that. You want to see the creatures we've already found? Great! Okay, then. Well, we'll get there. See you soon! We still have more dinos to find! Well, we got the picture, but I guess it's not going to show. Hey, what are you saying, Matthew? Now we're 150 million years back in time? Boy, every time I turn around, it's some other time all the time. Come on. What are you guys Looking at these rocks, I see fossils from millions of years before the Jurassic period just waiting to be unearthed. If we could dig them up, oh, what a story they tell. Rocks tell you a story? My mom had a pet rock, <laughs> but uh, it never said anything. Hmm. That was horrifying. What are you going to do, Liz? Hi, Liz. Oh, welcome back, Liz. Uh, Carlos. Oh, there you are. Never heard of the Tethys Sea? Don't worry, it doesn't exist anymore. But it was the Jurassic's tropical sea, and it appeared right where the continent started to split up. Cool. What about you, DA? Fascinating. We're in the Tethys Sea, a warm tropical sea in the Jurassic period. DA, it's the only tropical sea in the Jurassic. Besides the Tethys Sea, there's just one huge ocean surrounding all the continents. Cool. Oh, right. You'll get a kick out of the Arnold Plesiosaur in Morphosaurus. You want to see what Arnold and Wanda would look like as dinosaurs? Click on Liz to morph them with the dinosaur in the little box. Let's see. What is this? That's a Corythosaurus. See what you look like. <laughs> well, it's kind of bully, but it's fun. That was cool. Uh. Dear, I wish I looked like that. You're about to, Wanda. I don't think that's a good color for Arnold. Good morphing on your part. <laughs> Morphing always makes me That was cool. Oh my goodness. Now you see it. That was cool. <laughs> Morphing always makes me That was cool. That was cool. Oh, what do you look like then? Oh. Yeah, See? The more things change, the more they remain the same. Really rough it. Okay. This one. Let's do one. Oh my goodness! That was cool. Well. Good morphing on your part. Eh, this is basically just a morphosaurus. Hey! Don't ever change, unless you're coming back for some morph. Weak puns, weak puns. Okay, let's see what we gotta go get next. This reptile had a long neck like a giraffe, but you won't find it on land. I'd be most obliged if you could replace this missing photo with one of your own. This sea swimmer used its four flippers to swim through water and hunt for fish. I followed this fierce fish eater from a safe distance as it looked for prey in the Tethys Sea. See you soon. We still have more dinos to find. Well, I guess this campaign isn't going to get us anywhere. I love how there's just a normal fish right here. There's a dolphin in the background, or... Whatever I was looking for before. Jello. 
家猫，什么猫呢？哦，什么猫呢 ？Seriously, that where is it? Oh my gosh! Before the game crashed the first time, it was like always on screen. Come on, where are you? What happens if I take a picture of Carlos? Oh, face? that's not the critter we're looking for. Don't worry, though. Just keep trying. What about this fish? You are not the fish I am looking for, but I'll take your picture of this. Aha! Hmm, that's not the right animal either. Maybe we should look in another location. No, we're good. We're in the Tethys Sea. Are you in? No, oh, you're not in. Come on. Shamona. Look at that. I didn't know sharks existed way back in the Jurassic period. Shark. Yikes. Dinos or no dinos, I knew this place was dangerous. I was kind of hoping someone was going to say that it was a herbivore, but whatever. I'm just hanging out in the Tethys Sea. I got in Alberta last episode, so now we're just going to hang out in the sea. Oh my goodness! Okay, we're going this way. Hopefully this doesn't lead us somewhere that we should be. Our prehistoric picnic proceeds! Coming up, Colorado! Colorado was always my favorite place to be. So as always, we will play the minigame here. Attention Jurassic shoppers! Have we got a bargain for you? Here in Colorado, you'll find a blue light special on stegosaurs, sauropods, and any kind of cycad. Are you in the minigame? Nope, you're the minigame. Help us, stegosaurs! Steer clear of danger and meteor meltdown! Oh no, I forgot this game. You can help a herbivore find food in a dangerous place, but first, click on the dinosaur you want to play. Spiky Stegosaurus is tough, but the two-legged Hypsilophodon is fast. Go with the uh, Hypsilophodon then, shall we? Level one. How do you do this? Oh boy. Yeah. Let's do it. Level two. Level two. So this is one of my one of the mini games I enjoy the most. So now you can see where my game play. Oh my goodness. The game play. Oh my goodness. Shots coming. In. Come on, come on. Who knew it was this puppy a dinosaur? Oh, that many dinosaurs. Hey, there it is. Paleo card. Nice going. Guess you want a paleo card. Is it me? Yeah. Level yeah. three. Oh, when you start yeah. on one of the objectives, that's just great. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Right, I forgot about this. Yeah. Is it? Mm. Yeah. Well, yeah, I guess yeah. this level. Yeah. Kind of yeah. You start to flood, so you have to Level cover. four! Oh, my goodness. I feel like that's incentive to make mistakes. Nice. Boom! Paleo card. Nice! Go! Don't you want a paleo card? So paleo cars are kind of like the collectibles in this game. Level five. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Level six. Oh, I don't know. Oh boy. Another paleo card, everyone. 
right? How did you dodge all those meteors? You're so good, you win a paleo car! To be completely honest with you, I've never actually been good enough Level at this seven. game to find out when it ends, or if it ends. It could just be randomly generated infinitely! Oh my gosh. Cool. Level eight. Well. There's another one. How did you dodge all those meteors? You're so good, you win a paleo car. Level nine. I wonder if there's like a world, if this is random and generated, I wonder if there's a world where I can have like a dead end of stuff. Level ten. Level ten. Oh my goodness. Uh, there's another thing I got there. And you won this Missy Paleo card! So like ten levels? Wow! You play my game better than I do! You're a Meteor Meltdown Master! Oh, cool. What did I say my name was? Dextrasaurus. Boom. Wow, look at this high score! Yay! Now it's time for more Meteor Meltdown! I'm sorry, can I continue? You can help a herbivore find food in a dangerous place. But first, click on the dinosaur you want to play. Spiky Stegosaurus is tough, but the two-legged Hypsilophodon is fast. Well, let's go with Level this one. guy. Level 1! Cool oh my gosh, he's uh... slow. <laughs> Nice. Level two. Well, there's only ten levels. Get it out. Yeah. It's a meteor meltdown. How did you dodge all those meteors? You're so good, you win a paleo car. Oh, thank you. Level three. Oh, you are so close to a friendly. Right, this is where the challenge comes in for the Stegosaurus. Because you are so slow. That's one time to spend your way to get it. Level 4! Yeah, another belly of cars. How did you dodge all those meteors? You're so good, you win a paleo card. Yeah, a paleo card. I Level like five. paleo cards. <laughs> Level 
I feel like speed's more of an asset for this game. Oh, don't, don't get any more easier. I won't make you any easier. Ha 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 you already knew that. How did I run into a meteor? I wasn't there. Mm -hmm. Beat the meteor. Beat the meteor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bad, 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 bad. Oh, yeah, skills. Nice going. Guess you want a paleo card. Was it I? Let me know. I wonder what happens. Oops. I wonder what happens. You fall into the water. Level 10. Nice. Level 10. Oh, I might not have a choice. I might figure it out. Oh, yeah, no, please. Oh, my goodness. That's bad. Yikes! Those meteors will get you every time. Oh, shoot. That's shoot. Yikes! Those meteors yeah, will get you every time. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Why don't you get pulled out of there? Uh oh, another meteor meltdown in the fortune. Well then, Dextrasaurus. There you go. Yay. <laughs> okay, whatever. Well, that's going to do it for this one, guys. We're hopefully going to uh, head back to the Tithis, Tithis, Thistis, the Thistle Sea. We're going to go back to the Thistle Sea next time. And when we get there, at the Thistle Sea, we'll get a picture of that other, uh, that other thing we need. The fish with the long neck. Whatever. See you guys next time. Thank you.